Well, looks like another one's biting the dust. OB1 plays. Yes, right. What's up? Oh, All right. OB1 plays. going on everybody how are y'all doing we have a pretty pretty big gaming news item but before we get into it give the video a huge thumbs up like if you're not subscribed click subscribe for the latest and greatest in gaming news now this one is really heating up it looks like PlayStation is about to buy Square Enix in its entirety. Now, it's recently uh, been confirmed, revealed that um, Square Enix has sold some of its uh, teams to Embracer Group, um, IP such as Duis X, um, Tomb Raider, and so forth. But check this out. This is coming from Comic Book Gaming, ComicBook.com. <laughs> PlayStation Insider and former IGN writer Greg Miller has corroborated a rumor that Sony has reportedly had was reportedly in talks to inquire acquire Square Enix. Wow. According to Greg Miller, he had heard rumblings of PlayStation trying to buy Square Enix a while ago. Both Miller and journalist Jeff Grubb teased a big PlayStation related acquisition a few weeks ago but couldn't share specifics. Miller went on to note that the information he was given wasn't explicit meaning he wasn't sure if the whispered he had heard referred to Square Enix Western Studios or the Japanese side of the publisher. Grubb had previously stated that he had also heard that Square Enix, the Square Enix acquisition rumor, but seemed to echo Miller's thoughts about the lack of clarity on specifics. Whether or not Sony lost out on a deal on those Western teams remains a mystery. PlayStation remains bullish in its effort to acquire more talent, but hasn't indicated who it has its eyes on. It's possible Sony wanted to acquire Square Enix Japanese team, but that meant the Western teams had to be sold off to someone else first. <laughs> so, it looks like um, Sony wants to buy Square Enix, the Japanese studios. That's where Final Fantasy and where the bread and butter of Square Enix is. But they couldn't buy both the um, Japanese studios and the Western studios. So Square Enix had to sell off the Western studios first so Sony could um, possibly acquire the remainder of Square Enix. Now, this is still in the rumor field, but very, very interesting. I mean, this generation has been the generation of studio acquisitions. Um, Microsoft is buying a big studios, the biggest of them all, possibly in Activision. And so it looks like Sony is responding. I think Sony is more strategic with their acquisitions. They're just not going to just buy a studio just to buy it because of their first party sales, game sales on their platform. I think uh, Microsoft is looking at a more holistic picture that they don't care too much um, if they they buy a studio and they'll still sell their games on the sony platform microsoft is all about making that money and so what do you guys think about sony and uh, the rumors heating up that they're about to buy square enix some big 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 stuff sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go bro click that subscribe button stay up to date all things gaming bro we out Peace.